Alrighty guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the basement. It is your boy Brian and we are live here for episode number 10 of the WWE 2K22 My Rise series. Last episode, we had the biggest match of the series so far where we beat Damian Priest for the NXT North American Championship. So now we got a little bit of gold around our waist. Let's head back to the locker room and see if the landscape has shifted a little bit. Story complete, the bounty. We got 40 upgrade points, 11,000 fans, and a pretty nice looking North American title. Hey, look who's there to congratulate us. We got Hector Flores and the big Mark, Mark Thompson. I think we gotta go chat with Hector first. Let's go see what Hector's gotta say to the new NXT North American Champion. You've seemed a bit off lately. What's going on? I mean, aside from getting jumped backstage and bounties being put on my head, I think things have been kind of normal. But I don't know if you just saw me out there. I'd just be Damian Priest and, and I'm the new North American Champion. So how about you address me with the congratulations? It's just some family stuff. I don't really want to get into it. <laughs> Dude, my dumb ass thinking that that was what Hector said. That's what I said to Hector. So Hector's kind of going through it right now. H Hector's going through some family stuff. He doesn't really want to get into it. Maybe in, maybe me and Hector just got to go out and grab a brewski, get a beer, and, and talk it over. Dealing with that is sometimes way harder than anything we face in the ring. That's true, man. I hear you. Hey, actually, I need a partner for a tag match. Would you be willing to team up with me? Might be a good way to get my mind off of everything. Hmm, Hector, 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 you want to tag up for a match. I like you, Hector. I do. But I just won the North American Championship. Do I need to be throwing myself into a tag match? No, but you know what? It'd be doing an old buddy a favor. I guess yeah. I can do it. I guess I could do it. Ay, gracias. Um, any kind of strategy you want to discuss before we team up? You know what? Yeah, let's talk a little strategy. I think I'll start the match off. You know what I'm saying? I'll do my work, I'll put I'll put that work in, and then I'll tag you, and you can get the pin. How's that sound? All I care about is trying to get you the win. Maybe that will help break you out of your funk. That's not necessary, but I appreciate it. We're just a good guy. This is the spin that we needed. We're slowly, slowly turning face a little. You know what I'm saying? It was the beating up backstage that got the sympathy. I still like to come through and, and wreck shit. I'm not gonna lie. I have fun doing that, but I still don't want to be an ass. I don't want to be a mean guy. I'm a nice guy. Hey, I'm a nice guy. All right. For whatever reason, we're coming out to Kushida's stuff, but it's me and Hector making our tag team debut together. We came up in the PC together and we're looking to score a big W. For whatever reason, we're not coming out with the title. I don't know what's good with that, but uh, you know, maybe we kept it in the locker room. Or, you know what, maybe we just left it at home for safekeeping. Because it's clear that the locker room is not a safe place to keep things you don't want stolen. But it's me and Hector. Alright, so first off, it's the Brian Kendrick. This man has been around longer than I can remember. I remember watching Brian Kendrick growing up, teaming up with Paul London. And then his singles run he had with Zeke Jackson. So this guy, this guy is somebody I respect. We share a name. I'd hate to do it to you, but if I have to put you down, I gotta put you down. So they're gonna send us the Irish ace, Jordan Devlin. This dude just got a, a perpetual stank face though. More like the Irish arse if you ask me, but we're just gonna go about it. We're not gonna ask questions. We're doing Hector a favor. All right, Hector, let's do it, man. You and me. Weird tag match, but... It's for Hector. Oh, Enziguri caught him. We're starting off high. All right, we're going to step through. Here we go. Penalty kick. And the double stomp. Cover. Quick cover. One. Two. Ooh, I thought we were going to get a quick two count out of that. All right, what do you say, Hector? You want some action? What do you say, Hector? You want some action? Let's get you in here. All right, Hector. Let's do it. Oh! Over the top. Oh, but Brian's able to counter. And now Kendrick gonna send us up and over. And Brian Kendrick just soaking in. And taking a moment to admire his handiwork. But that might have been a bad idea as Hector is rolling on the outside. And Hector... Showing everybody that he is numero uno. Let's handle it in the ring. 
Leapfrog and a quick drop down. Hector with the tilt the world backbreaker. Okay, Hector. Keep a fresh man in. Always. Always keep a fresh man in. Alright, we're going for it again. And we're just gonna throw him up and over. One more time. That back is getting abused. One. Two. Kick out at two from Kendrick. As expected. Oh. But come on. Oh, Brian quick to his feet after that one, man. That was a serious shot. Oh. Kendrick gonna fire back. And now taking us into the corner. Where he's gonna make the tag to Jordan Devlin. Double super kick, stereo super kicks from Devlin and Kendrick. As we're rattled a little bit, a little bit shook here. And now Devlin, oh! Making us look small with that suplex. Now Devlin's a guy I'm a little bit more afraid of, if I'm being honest with you. This guy hits a little bit harder than Kendrick. I feel like he's got a, a mean streak to him a little more than Kendrick does. But it's clear that they don't really have much of a plan here. As we're just going to fire all kinds of chops. But Kendrick going to block one. Uh-oh. Oh. Butterfly suplex there from Kendrick in the corner. Able to get a one count out of us. Kendrick feeds us into the corner. Oh! He draw. Oh! Dodges the Inziguri. Catches the kick. It's chop time! 98 knee! Let's get him into the corner. Come on, Hector. Let's do something big. Alright, Hector. Everybody put your hands in the air. I was expecting something bigger, but we'll take it. No! Hot tag! And here comes Devlin! Oh! 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 Uh-oh. We're able to slip it. DDT from Flores! Devlin is in trouble! Look at that! Gory bomb! And his neck cut all of that bottom rope! One! Two! Oh, but the ropes ultimately saving Devlin. They caught him on the way down, but they're keeping him in this match. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Hector saying, eat my dust. We're going to look to make a tag. And now here comes another tag. This time we're going to that middle rope. Oh, we went for the takeout. But Kendrick. Get over here. Get in here now, buddy. Oh! Oh, we caught him with the NZ! That's right. Oh! But maybe that was a bad idea. We got distracted. And now Devlin. Gonna fire away! Devlin side! The Devlin side! Suplex there from Devlin! No! Nope. Oh, there's a big forearm! Devlin blocking everything we've got but that was enough to catch him but he's pushing us off Irish whip and it's gonna take us over and Devlin saying this is all about him I don't know about that one buddy you're, you're in the ring with the North American champion not gonna be that easy nope just gonna send him into that barricade oh ooh, that was vicious but the crowd is all for it. And you know what? We're a champion. We're going to handle this match with a little bit of class and respect. We're going to get back in the ring and let him join us. We're not going to keep on beating him up outside. 98 knee! Taking out Kendrick! Hit it, Hector! Oh, but Devlin gets over! Devlin... And now, Brian Kendrick and Devlin back in it. They're back in this one. The tides have turned. And now he's going right back for the fresh man. Maybe it was a bad idea. There's that leapfrog. 
Drop down. Drop down. Oh, he's just gonna throw him up and down. Cover. One, two. Oh, kick out at two, even though Kendrick was right there. And now Kendrick and O'Reilly are gonna go at it. Kick was caught by Devlin. Elbow drop. And now Hector. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, there's Devlin stopping Hector in his tracks. Devlin is just too much for us right now. Oh. No. What? We missed the kick. And Devlin is just going to throw us over it again. Where are we? Oh my gosh, there we are. Getting back into this one. Look at us and Devlin. Hey. Hey, yo. Devlin, we got to talk. That's not cool. Big clothesline from Hector. Trying to get in for the tag. We got him up again. Gory bomb! Down goes Kendrick! We've got him! Hector's got him! Uh-oh! Brain buster from Flores! Is that gonna do it? One, two, three! Hector Flores with the brain buster! Picks up the W and we're hyped for Hector. Look at him. We got Hector out of his funk. We picked up a W. Hopefully that win was enough to get Hector out of his little funk he was in. Hopefully we're able to cheer him up with a W tonight. All right, Hector. How you feeling, bro? You no, know, we got the win out there tonight, but I apologize. I was definitely not on top of my game. I could tell. I know you said you didn't want to talk about your family stuff, but what the heck is going on? Yeah, tell me, man. All right. You have to promise not to tell anyone else about it. Deal? Definitely not crossing yeah, my fingers. I promise. So my father has been in touch with me. Okay. I thought you were on speaking terms. Yeah, me too. We weren't. Well. But since I made it to NXT, he's been contacting me all the time. Mm. So why is that a bad thing? Because I haven't been honest with you or anyone else about my background or who my dad is. My father is El Mago Singh. Oh. Wait, I'm confused. What about that wrestler El Mago Jr.? Yeah. Is he your brother? And why hide all this in the first place? Let's go with that. Let me explain. When I first decided to get into wrestling, mm -hmm. I wanted to carry on my father's name and become a Mago Jr. Naturally. But my dad didn't think I had what it took to make it and decided to sell the name to the guy who's now a Mago Jr. Ooh. It really hurt that he put his faith in some stranger instead of his own son. Facts. Ever since then, I've been determined to make it on my own without my father's help or namesake. I like it. Wow. Well, I guess that explains why you wanted nothing to do with his retirement show a while back. Yeah. Exactly. And that was fine just doing my own thing, but now that I've had some success and made it to NXT, my father suddenly wants me to be a Mago Jr. Hmm. Interesting timing. Yeah. And worse, he's even convinced NXT management it's a good idea. Oh. This is the last thing I ever wanted. My father should have no part of my success when he never once believed in me before this. Well, we believe in you, Hector. We gotta help Hector save this issue, man. Okay. I think I know how you can get rid of this problem. Like, as in, get rid of my father? What? No. Nah. We just have to take away the prestige of the El Mago name by exposing El Mago Jr. and in turn your dad as frauds. That's... Then, this will all go away. Yeah, that's better than, than doing... How do we do that? Doing him dirty. Just follow my lead. In the meantime, we should continue competing on NXT like nothing's up. That's right. Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. My name is Brian. We are live from the basement. Make sure you guys tune in tomorrow for episode number 11 of the My Rise series. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.